Hey guys, welcome back to Nanotail. Where this is where we left off. I just realized that we can just use this pet that is following us around. We use this as platform to activate this electricity. So we go push and just sunset is good enough. Come here, push and survivor. So it gets deactivated and immediately gets activated back up. Do I need to... How do I use this? How do I use this skill that I have? Hold left shift to summon no... Hold spacebar then type an enemy word to possess it. What? So if these are not enemies, and I guess they don't really count. I have no idea what is going on. Why doesn't this work? <sighs> what? <laughs> that guy just disappeared. I can lower another one here. I mean, I, I can't go in. I hope I can still get out. I guess that is the way. Is that the way?
doesn't seem like I can affect these, uh, I can affect these electric rods without Oh, I can just go <laughs> I can just go around I just realized that, oh, I was like, oh, I just uh, all the way around and uh, I I can just get onto the other side of it. So now I have the lightning skill, is it? Spell of Zap. So I can just zap and... Zap will affect these things. It's that... it's just a plant. Can't really go down anymore. There are a couple of things, I think those are on the bottom. Yeah, those are on the bottom there. Not up top. There's still... There's still that. I can freeze. Okay, where is my pet? <laughs> pet dinosaur? Follow me? No? There we go. Okay, grab that. There's one more up here. Helix Nest. There's something up here. Okay, I think after, if I continue to go up here, then I go, uh, yeah, that's going back. That's the way back to the other area, to the main first area.
So... what? The scavengers think it is a spring of magic. I think it is pollution from whatever Madoc is up to in his crazy tower of power. <sighs> wow. Is it pollution? <laughs> Yeah, in this in this desert area, these these things, these collectibles are less visible. These ancient bones were once the ribs of an unknown creature. But what did this creature look like? How long ago did it roam these lands? Nobody knows. This may be Maddox's most ingenious invention. By using a hybrid of science and magic, he grew ice cubes on the Vix Frost branches. This is how you can live in a desert. Well, when you're living in a desert, you have to be creative, I guess. When the larvae have burst from the eggs, they feast on any roots and plants they can find. Zephyr snakes. Follow your own path. Okay, there are a couple of collectibles here, let's get them. Here are these runes. Heal up. Something uh need to get down. Get down go over here. Mad dock. Zap Ray Mystic. Hmm. Haha. 
There we go. The Great Zana has the strongest wood imaginable. Some scavengers consider it vital resource in rebuilding Sun City, whereas others favor its magical potency. And this creature. So what you need to do, do there is to make sure that these two in the middle here, they're not switched. They are either both turned on or both turned off. Uh, you can turn... You can do that by... Uh, like I, I had... I'm not sure if this is correct, but I had... Um, when I first arrived here, this was off, on, on, and off. So if you just... Um, so the middle two are on, so if you... Uh, wait. I think it was on... I, I, okay, I don't remember, but because if it's the middle two are both on and the other two are off, then I just need to just do a simple zap the flower in the middle and that's it. But that, that wasn't, it wasn't that simple like that. So I had to do a ray on this, on these two, um, and to switch this off and then to switch these three to on and then you can do a ray to get the, all these three to turn off at the same time. You, of course you have to position yourself correctly. Or another way is you have to somehow turn the other two off and then uh, and leave the middle two on and then you do the flower. Uh, simple, just tap, zap it, and that's, and then you can, uh, you can do it. So there's a bunch of collectibles in here. I'm gonna try to get them all. I think I can get them all. Sweetness. Sometimes an overpowering sweetness drifts on the air. And when I hear the fluttering butterfly wings, I know I'll soon come upon a flowering May. Very nice. Oh, that's only one of the things to turn off. Need this little guy here. Zap, ray, and stones. Scavengers protect the Kara from any foreign poachers that hunt them for their valuable crystals. The stones deliver a constant supply of nutrients, and without them, the Kara would die of starvation. <laughs> I mean, I didn't, uh... I didn't realize that there's still more collect bows, <laughs> more things I can collect. Okay, come over here. Zap, right, swoons. It's okay, so this is open now. But what does this do? It doesn't do anything.
Um... The outlandish sand sculptures are actually Zephyr snake nests. This is just ridiculous. I am stuck. Oh my god, stuck again? Okay, finally I'm down. <laughs> Oh my god, these <laughs> stupid puddles. Only in the oasis. Their delicate roots need a continuous supply of water. If they were paired with the Vix Frost, would they grow in drier lands? This maze is so annoying. <sighs>
What? Can't get over. Oh my god, that took me forever <laughs> to just make these lands to walk around. It is tradition for families to gather under the May and watch the butterflies over a cup of Tara fermented syrup. This practice is reminiscent of the dweller's tradition. Okay, I got this one and then... Just this one, this one is a little bit, I don't know why I can't see this plant. This plant doesn't seem to want to get discovered. Push large out back. Just clear everything. Yep, I can't seem to get that. That one single collectible. Oh my god. I will have to make bridges. Let's go. Let's try to make these bridges.
Can I do an ice? And how do I... get that? No, 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 no. Um, I go... Zap, Ray, Large, and Bearing? It's close, but no dice. Ray, zap. Okay, I see. So the... I see, I see now. So the Zap can only spawn these droid plants out from the sand. The non-sandy parts... I will have to use water? The Zephyr's eggs travel with the warm wind. When landing in the hot sand, the eggs break. Allowing the larva to dig in. Now what? Are there any of those dinosaurs for me to draw upon? Okay, so I open up a shortcut. What? These are memorials for the storm victims. The scavengers don't seem to blame Madoc or his son. Everyone lost someone, they say, and everyone grieves. Thunderstones. I don't know where to go. Uh, I'll try to find ways to either access over here. I think maybe if I go down, maybe this path, I can find a way to open the gates and then go up here. But for now, um, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this series. I mean, it seems like it's really close. Things are bringing up to light. And uh, I think it's coming up soon. It's co the ending is coming up soon. Because you're subscribing. And I will see you next video. Peace.